Well, hello there, Dukely here, and today I'm playing Starbound, probably my new favorite game. Uh, I got this as a gift um, for Christmas times, and um, it's a lot like Terraria, except it's this one is more got more stuff to it, and it's spacey, and um, I just like it more. Whatever. Um, so yeah, here's my ship. I got a couch. Oops, I already. Excuse me? There we go. So we got a couch. Can sit on that. Got a fridge, a stove, you know, some chairs. Got my sleeping quarters. And then, uh, here's the, uh, the navigation screen. You can, uh, this is massive. Look at this. It's massive. And I click it in one of these at random. Here we go. And look. Okay, I'll click this one. And great, that one has, you know, five more fucking planets inside that. So it's massive map. I've unlocked the beta sector. So basically, you fight a monster, boss monster, and then um, you get the parts you need to uh, go to the next sector. And next I need to create um, the robot and get a brain um, and create the robot boss man and I'll be able to go to the next sector which I assume is, well, I don't know, one that starts with C. Um, a, B, C? Or G, maybe? I... whatever. Um, yeah, so... Here's my base, my home world. Um... I got some security cameras. Uh, a lot of stuff that we've just stolen from places, because I'm playing this with Apollo. I mean, you got your bathroom in here? Excuse me! And then, um... Down here we've got, uh... The armory. Which doesn't have a whole lot of, of shit in it, because obviously we're carrying the best things with us. Uh, and, you know, there's an anvil. We're gonna add a kitchen in over here. And, uh... We had a cola machine, all kinds of shit. Some bedrooms. Um, I mean, we've got this force field so that birds would fly into it and die. This is, like, the workshop area. And, uh, over here is just a wall to keep bad guys out. If we go this way... We've got one of our Apex residents there. Um, this is gonna be another kind of quarters area soon. It's just not been completed. Um, there's a couple of these burning barrels out here just to keep shit like lit up. Uh, and yeah, I mean this game is great. It's got procedurally generated planets apparently even though you can find coordinates and say I go back to my ship. <coughs> I'll show you what I mean. So I don't know if it is procedurally generated, like the planets might have been generated randomly, but they're all like set at this point, I think. So like if you p put in these coordinates, you will find this planet, and it'll probably look exactly the same. Now I don't know if what that's about, but anyway, it's, it's, it's interesting to have a bajillion million planets, so I guess that they wouldn't all be able to... Um, be hand built, so they'd have to be procedurally generated at some point. What the fuck am I talking about? All right, so we'll go somewhere new here. Um, we'll have a look around my home system, since I haven't really looked in all these places yet. A level seven forest. All right, let's have a look at there. So we'll just hit go. It uses up 50 fuel for this area. Um, the ship runs on wood and coal because it's you know a Victorian a Victorian ship. So here we go. We'll have a sit on the couch. Ooh. And over here is a big ape is all seen, because I'm an apex. So I got that poster from a, a laboratory that I shot a bunch of uh, other monkeys in. Got my, what's this called? A metal workstation. So you can build all kinds of equipments and, sh and shit. Even though the best stuff is uh, things you find. Oh yeah, I got this gun now. Because you can find these, like, anchors that are in the ground. If you see, like, an anchor on the, the ground and um, you can go up it, like if you nerd pull up it, you'll find um, a pirate ship and they will sell you guns. Yeah, pretty crazy, I know. There's all kinds of cool stuff in this game. Like, sometimes you can just find a penal colony. And, um... Oh, what else did I find? Like, some laboratories. I found a jumping puzzle that had, like, some technology in it. So now I can do this which is like a double jump. So we're going to beam down here and have a look around. It's very similar to my home planet, actually. 
It's got a lot of the same things. Okay, we got some some iron here. I'll just go ahead and get that. Great. Not really necessary for me anymore at this point. I have so much iron. Oop, hostile creatures. Oop, missed. Yep, that's a piece of ground. Gotcha. 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 Give me your money. Because all these creatures carry wallets. <clears throat> pixels is the currency. Um, because technology is like so advanced that they use pixels for everything. For like 3D printing and shit. I guess. Even though the 3D printer doesn't actually work in the game yet. Beta people. And um... They've already updated this since I've played it at least twice. Um, this is actually the second time I've shot this Vigia, because uh, the first one um, got corrupted on my computer, so that was fun. That's a little money container. Some horses there, whatever the fuck they are. All the um, creatures are random too. So I've also noticed if you get to like a really flat part that's just like one level and it goes on for a really long time, you're gonna find something good. Well, that's interesting. That was like a sentry bot for some kind of like laboratory. There's another one. Aha! A laboratory! Just as I expected. Let's have a look. Aha! There's the security guard. Got him. All right, let's have a look in this uh, this place here. I'm gonna take these. Because they look nice, and they're decorative and whatnot. Okay, there's a cleaning robot. He likes to clean. That's his job, he cleans. Got him. Oh, look! Some more cola machines! Hello! It's just a robot that doesn't do anything. This is like some nuclear waste and shit over here. Can I take this? Oh yeah, radioactive barrel! Sweet! It's gonna take it all. The light's nice too, I'll take the light. So yeah, I played like 30 hours of this game so far. Uh, it's pretty good, it's a game I'm going to in my free time now. Um, and I mean, it's only in beta. So, I mean, it's probably gonna get even better. Oops, sorry. Just ice that random fucker. And yeah, it's, uh, what's today? It's the 8th today. I'm playing on beta version Irritated Koala, I think that's what it's called. So if you are seeing things that are, or things are different at this point, um, that's why. Because this might be old for you. Also, I'm surprised if you're still watching this video, because I've done a pretty shitty job so far. No matter! I'd like one of these cleaning robots, they're quite nice. Storage crate with nothing in. Oh, some money in that one. I take these wooden ones. Oh, I take the... I mean the metal ones. I take the wooden ones too, though. They, um... They like crates, except better, because you can stack them. Um... Or, they're like chests, but you can stack them. Um... Which is much better, because especially on your ship, where you don't have a whole lot of space, that's a much better thing. So I think I went down that one already. Let's go down here. I am quite hurt. I'm going to eat some bandages. And I just realized that, no, we didn't go down this way, because I'm an idiot. It's not necessary. Ooh, that's close. Took a couple of hits there. Alright. Got a library. I think those, those little robots kind of look like Cylons to me. Okay, empty. It's empty. Got him. Oh, he dropped money. Let's just grab that. Yeah. I hadn't checked any of the bookcases. Oh, we got, uh, the beast. Okay. Oh, I'm getting a bit hungry. It's the same thing. I don't need the same book again. Okay. Ah, oh, let's go this way. Hello? There's nothing in here. Although, these are great. These floodlights. I'll take that. I will take that. 
So, uh, after the Christmas time, the bathroom in there, um, I might start doing some live stream things again because I'll actually have, um, ooh, Kiwi. I'll actually get a, a decent, um, webcam at some point. Uh, so I'll be able to, uh, do some live streaming probably on YouTube, but I don't know yet. Um, and this is one of the things I was planning on live streaming. So you have to let me know if you want to see more of this. Makes it a lot quicker to get around with the, the double jump there. Oh! Hello! Who? I'm hurt a bit. Oh shit! No! Don't kill me! Gotcha! Look behind you, it's your imminent doom! You're so funny. There's a couch in here. Oh, look at this. Got him. Open fire! I got your shitty axe too, guy. What are you gonna do about that? So these facilities are really common. I found a number of these. Uh, facilities. I'm getting low on all kinds of healings. My heals. Low on the heals. Just gonna fire randomly because I don't know. Oh shit. That was a lot of damage that guy just did. You killed Mitchman. Mitchmon. Mitchmon. Yeah, I killed Mitchmon, and I'll do it again. Look at this chair! Holy shit! I'm taking that. That's great. It's a great chair. Absolutely fantastic chair. Take these. Glass panels are quite nice. You can decorate your shit up real good with them. Oh, yeah. Alright. So, like I said, you can find these coordinates if you guys want to come to this exact same base with me. Once we go back to my ship, you can see uh, what they are. Boom! You have to be all clear of um, underground areas before you can go back to your ship. For some reason. Can I actually, um... Nope. I can't replace the chair. I kind of wanted that other one, though. The other one was quite interesting. So yeah, there's the coordinates for where I am. Yeah, let's have a look around. Um... Oh yeah, let's try this one. Who knows? Who knows what we'll find? Fuel that up there. Top that off. Alright. I'm gonna have a little nap here. And, uh... This will take a minute to get there, and then we'll be there, and we'll get to do stuff. Oh, whoops. <laughs> we have arrived. Wait for it. Once we get into position... We'll just warp right down. Almost there now. You didn't have to get up. Okay. Let's have a look around. Oh, shit. That thing launched a fireball at me. It's quite rude. Some iron there. Oh, he's cool. Alright. So yeah, that's, it's a lot like Terraria. Um, and I really like Terraria. I have like 300-something hours on record for my Steam of Terraria. That's a lot. Um, I also did a series of videos on Terraria that involved helping people who don't know what the fuck they were doing to play. Um, I haven't considered making any for this game but I suppose I could. Although I feel like it's already been covered widely by much bigger names on the YouTube, so I would... I, I mean, I don't think I'm gonna do well. This video's probably not gonna do real well. Only my subscribers will probably see this video anyway. Um, but yeah, if you, if you did find this video and you're not a subscriber of mine, why not? I'm interesting, I think. I don't even know. Um... But yeah, I, it's, uh, if people want to see more of this, I'll gladly play more of this. It's a fun game, and I've been playing with Apollo. We could do some co-op videos on it. Tons of co-op videos with him already, but, you know, never hurts to have more co-ops. There's a lot of bones here. Oh, very bony. 
planet. Gotcha. I don't know, I'm not seeing anything interesting. Um, that's kind of weird. What's this? Oh, nothing. Excuse me? Yeah. Fish in a barrel. Mmm, fish in a barrel. So yeah, I really don't know, uh... What else to go on about? This is this is like a weekend extra video. It's gonna, I'm gonna put this up today, probably once it's done being edited, which is not gonna take long because, quite honestly, I don't think there's anything early to edit. And uh, yeah, I think uh, I think I'll finish it here, and I will uh, I'll see you guys later for uh, some some games and stuff. So this has been a pretty bad video because you know still a bit tired, just got up, but maybe you've enjoyed it, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.